The Analysis and Planning category recognizes excellence in the wide variety of professional activities that lead to, guide, or evaluate landscape architecture design. Receiving honor awards are the Park and New Town Upon the Fish Ponds, the planning of 2007 China International Garden Show Park Area by Atelier DYJG. This project proposes a new development for Xiamen, China, to replace fish ponds that threaten the safety of a water reservoir. A garden show, bird habitats, an arboretum, and waterfront access will be integrated into the new town. The jury found it wonderfully contextual and said it makes a great effort to preserve the meaning of the fish ponds and the landscape architect deserves credit for this. Wild Horse Ranch by DHM Design. The clients for this project in southeastern Oregon sought solutions that were ecologically sustainable and culturally appropriate and still supportive of ongoing ranch operations. Native grass and original stream channels are restored and ranch buildings are carefully placed within the context of the landscape. The jury praised the landscape architect's light touch and called the work beautiful and intuitive. Atlanta Beltline Redevelopment Plan by EDA. This plan organizes green space, trails, transit, economic revitalization, and new development along 22 miles of historic rail segments that encircle the city's urban core. By attracting growth around public amenities and transportation, the plan seeks to reverse regional sprawl and create a more vibrant city. The jury applauded the proposal, saying it has extraordinary potential to transform Atlanta. Penn Connects, a vision for the future by Sasaki Associates. This well-executed plan provides a model for integrating the University of Pennsylvania campus into the surrounding urban fabric over the next 30 years. The outcome is a dynamic, mixed-use urban district that reclaims industrial sites and creates a vibrant gateway between West Philadelphia and University City. The jury praised the evocative, perspective sketches and found the project straightforward and impressive. University of Balamon Campus Master Plan by Sasaki Associates. This campus master plan in Lebanon respects the country's landscape and building culture. The plan is organized along a pedestrian path of learning with exterior spaces designed to encourage communication and interdisciplinary learning. Lebanese landscape architects were included in the team to promote traditional practice and establish a native plant vocabulary for the campus. Jurors said, we love how it is so simple yet displays incredible ability. Lower Howard's Creek Corridor Management Plan by Parsons Brinkerhoff in collaboration with Ned Crankshaw, ASLA, for Clark County Fiscal Court and the Friends of Lower Howard's Creek. This ambitious management plan developed protective and interpretive strategies for the landscape. The goal, to continue to portray its significant role in frontier settlements and the African-American experience in central Kentucky. The jury found it incredibly moving in preserving cultural legacy and demonstrating the majesty of things from the past. Open Space Seattle 2100, envisioning Seattle's green infrastructure for the next century by the University of Washington Department of Landscape Architecture and the Open Space Seattle 2100 Coalition. Led by landscape architects, this grassroots planning process engaged hundreds of multidisciplinary professionals and citizens in creating long-term plans for Seattle's green infrastructure. The results propose an illustrated framework of strategy to be adopted by the city. 
the jury called it extremely smart and effective, an important topic for every community. Receiving the Award of Excellence in Analysis and Planning is Hunters Point Waterfront Park Project by Hargraves Associates for Art Ecology. The landscape architects analyzed development potential and created concept plans for this decommissioned military base and Superfund site in San Francisco. Reconciling community desires with contentious issues of site contamination, the project makes a case for a large park as an economic generator, a catalyst for cleanup, and a critical step in achieving environmental justice for the neglected community. Jurors called the analysis totally on target and praised the amazing graphics, saying, landscape architects must start communicating this way to make a difference.